I'm Dave Asprey, founder of the Bulletproof Executive blog that gets more than 600,000 unique people visiting every month looking for ways to upgrade their body and their mind. With my executive coaching clients, I suggest that for six weeks they use the M-Wave or the inner balance sensor for 10 minutes a day, sometimes two 10-minute sessions. The reason for a six-week period is that that's the amount of time it takes you to form a new habit, and there's actually research about that. So when you form this new habit over six weeks, you get in the habit of turning off your sympathetic nervous system when it's overactive. You get in the habit of maintaining awareness of when you've shifted from parasympathetic dominance to sympathetic dominance. And I've heard nothing but amazing results from hundreds and hundreds of people who've read my blog or who've been coaching clients, and even from my own family. One of my clients is a stockbroker for one of the most successful hedge funds on earth. He flies all over the world on a regular basis. I convinced him to get the M-Wave, so he tried it, and he used it on an airplane, which, by the way, is one of the times I like to use it as well. He called me up when he landed, and he said, Dave, I'm really excited. I managed to get the light to turn green. It was green for 20 minutes. I felt so good. And then I thought about work, and the light turned red, and it stayed red for a half hour. It was kind of funny because he learned to control that response and then he went into the office and he sat in front of the trading screen and as soon as the market bell rang to open for trading, he went from green to red and he stayed red all day long. So he learned over the course of a few weeks how to keep himself in the green zone, how to turn off his fight or flight response and the net result was that he made better trades and he went home at night and was in a much better state of mind to work with his family and to do social things. So it turns out it upgraded his day job and his evening.